Hey, hey, hey guys, Doug is back with another exciting homebrewed update. Hey, got a lot of stuff for you this week. Um, been a pretty busy, hectic week. Um, first off, let's start off the beginning of the week. Uh, the Starting off this week, I got in the mail, I got some rhizomes from uh, my mail order place. Uh, I'll put the link down below where I got them from. Um, but they, I like this place because they come early and they're nice size rhizomes. Um, matter of fact, they forgot to send me one and they sent me a, another package out. It came right away. So, got some video of me planting those. Not the greatest video. I had two kids out there helping me, so bear with me, but check these out real quick. Say cheese. Hey, buddy. All right, guys, so we got our centennial rhizomes here. I'm actually missing one. You guys got like, what, two or three little buds on there? In there. Just cover it up. Cascades. I love version. Just plant up the two centennials. The next two are my limits. And then the next two. And the, the next one down here is a, I believe, a Howard Hall. Nugget. I'll have to double check that. And then the very back too, I got a Sarashi Ace. Try to win it right now, so we'll see how that works overall. So, all in all, I got one, two, three, four uh, first year ones, and the other ones are three years. Years. So that. As you can see, that kind of uh, completes my uh, my hotbeds. I need to get the uh, trellis and everything else done up on there. Uh, probably gonna get some mulch and stuff put on there. So yeah, the hops are gonna be uh, up in full swing here in a couple weeks or so. They're gonna be starting coming up out of the ground and and doing well. Excuse me, and they'll be starting doing well. So very much so looking forward to that. Um, also, in the mail. I know uh, Nate from under the table had got one of these a while back. I had uh, went ahead and got me one of these. I got this for fairly cheap. I'll have to look up the price. But I got it on Amazon. It took a long time to come in. Um, but this is going to be a lot better than those hot bags. I'm going to look forward to look looking forward to using this, definitely. Uh, and the most exciting thing that I had I have for this week was... I went down to O'Fallon Brewery in St. Louis, or O'Fallon, Missouri, 
um, and uh, did a little uh, did a little homebrew judging uh, for the AHA competition. This was quite the learning experience. Everybody was great down there. Um, I did a uh, category that was a little tough, uh, smoked wood aged beers category, but uh, yeah, it was interesting. Uh, very, very interesting. I had to go back down t on Saturday for a morning session and a evening session. So we'll see how this, uh, how that works out. I was like, I'm more so excited after doing one, one round of it. I'm more so excited to do another round. So yeah, that was uh, awesome. Check out, I got a little bit of brief footage. I didn't want to take too much footage of it because I was more there to absorb and learn than anything else. But maybe on Saturday I'll get some more footage of it. But check this out. Yeah, pretty exciting guys. That is all I have for you guys for this week. Cheers to everyone out there. Happy Humber Wednesday. Keep on fermenting.